The excitement of the courtroom can entice many people to want a career in the field of criminal justice. But becoming a lawyer or a judge can be intimidating and costly. Becoming a bailiff is not for everyone, as some people involved in court cases can get very violent when provoked or even told something that they don't like. However, there is one position which offers the excitement of the courtroom without a ton of schooling or the threat of bodily harm. And that job is being the court reporter. It obviously has its perks because that professional field is projected to grow by at least 15% within the next five years. One of those perks is the training. It only lasts from 18 to 33 months depending upon which school the prospective court reporter decides to pursue their education from. This training provides the student with all the latest information and techniques on court reporting and its technology. It covers a lot of things that have been developed recently. For example, the CAT, Computer Aided Transcription Software, that can be installed in a court reporter's stenograph is a part of the special training that these schools have to offer. There's also training that uses voice writing equipment to aid the court reporter in their job of making sure that every single word is recorded. There are certifications that can increase the court reporter's income as well. These certifications may vary from school to school, but they usually fall along the lines of these three. The CCR, which is the Certified Real-Time Reporter. The CBC, the Certified Broadcast Captioner and the CCP, the Certified CART Provider. If any of these certifications interest you, check with the school that you're going to to make sure that they have a program to offer this certification. Also, check with the State Department to see how a certification will change your income. Make certain the certification and the time and money that you will invest in it will be worth it in the end. Be absolutely certain that the college or university which you plan to take the court reporting courses at is approved by the National Court Reporters Association. If it's not, then look for another college or university that is. You don't want to waste your tuition on a place that does not have the proper classes which you're going to need for your degree and to be successful in the courtroom. If they don't provide that information, then find a different college or university. Another perk is the pay. In 2008, it was estimated that the median income of a court reporter was $45,610. That was an estimate of court reporters who worked for the federal government and had contracts through them. A freelance court reporter has the potential to make a lot more because they negotiate their own contracts. This also allows them to set their own schedules. If a court reporter has a certificate or a few of them and can use them well, that will also lead to a pay rise. The better they are at their job, the more recommendations they will receive and their pay will reflect that as well. Please visit us at courtreportersalarydata.com for more information on court reporting salaries and the training needed to get started in this exciting and lucrative career field.